a Singaporean recently took to social media to voice frustration over what he sees as a lack of driving skills of SG drivers, highlighting examples contributing to unsafe road conditions. He noted drivers' failure to understand road signs, including improper use of discretionary right turns and confusion at roundabouts. Additionally, he observed frequent and unnecessary braking. Even in situations where it's unwarranted and a lack of lane discipline, with drivers often swerving without signaling and crossing lane markings recklessly. Slow reaction times at traffic lights were also raised as a concern. He stated, when moving off traffic lights, will take like two seconds to process and when people cut them off, they will only horn after the person is in their lane. The horn is to warn people. If the person already finished a dangerous act, there's no point to warn. He added, there are many other issues that I didn't mention like not signaling slash road hogging slash refusing to give way, but that's common everywhere else in the world. Is it possible to teach PPL to drive better? One shed, no switching on turn signals when switching lanes is the most frustrating for me. Another proposed that it might be a pack city thing. He said, you can't compare it to other more sparse places. I mean, when I think of other pack cities e.g. BKK, JKT, the driving situation honestly is madness too. I do think the drivers there are more skilled. But driving there isn't for the faint-hearted. He added that he's not defending SG drivers, but thought SG drivers are generally more short-fused slash aggressive. One Singaporean noted that since cars are very expensive in the city-state and Singapore is too small for many cars. There's quite a large number of people who got a license, but didn't get to practice, so when they eventually got a car, they're already so rusty. Another Singaporean shared that a foreigner junior he talked with said she can't get used to Singapore drivers. Not knowing when to slow down. She said one thing she can't get used to is the fact that in Singapore, we slow down and stop only when getting very close to the traffic light line. She is always hesitant to cross the road even if the light is green because of this because a few more seconds distance and she'd get run over, he shared. Another just shared a recent example of bad driving he witnessed. He stated, just encountered just now, two cars dashing through the zebra crossing, even though they know there's pedestrians. In light of these driving challenges, here are some tips for safer driving. According to past driving, when driving, it's super important to keep safety in mind. Whether you're a new driver or have been driving for years, brushing up on your skills is always good. Sometimes, when you're going around corners, your car might skid if you're not careful. Remember these things. Avoid slamming on the brakes when turning, especially if you're going fast. Stay on the left side of the road to avoid crashing into oncoming cars. Ensure your car is in the right position before turning and slow down. Don't brake suddenly if you see sand or oil on the road. Just keep going steadily. Stay in your lane and let others know you're turning by signaling early. Always check your mirrors and look over your shoulder to see if it's safe to turn. Take a peek to the left to ensure no cyclists are around. Slow down and switch to a lower gear before turning and ensure you're in the right spot on the road. Watch for pedestrians and stop if you see a stop sign. Signal in advance and check your mirrors and blind spots. Look over your shoulder to the right to make sure it's clear. Get into the right lane in good time before the turn. Slow down when you reach the junction and stop if you need to. Look both ways for cars and watch out for people crossing the road. Look for signs that say you can do a U-turn and signal early. Check your mirrors and blind spots before you turn. Slow down, get into the right gear, and position your car correctly. 
Look out for other cars before you make your turn. Whether you're parallel or vertical parking, let others know what you're doing and ensure you're not too close to the curb. Check around your car to make sure it's safe to park. Always check your mirrors before driving, slow down, stop, change lanes, or turn. Also, keep an eye on other driver's signals. Remember, blind spots are the areas you can't see in your mirrors around your car. Check over your shoulder to see if it's clear before you change lanes, turn, or start driving. Don't drive in someone else's blind spot and keep your eyes moving while driving. Remember, driving safely isn't just about following the rules, it's about looking out for yourself and others on the road.